If you want to quickly remove background from your pictures without decreasing the quality of your image, this is the best solution, Photoroom. And how do I know that Photoroom is currently the best and the fastest background remover on the market? Well, I know this because I have tried them all. Yes, I have actually tested all background removers available in 2025. And to prove my point that Photoroom is really the best, I even use the biggest nightmare of all background removers, Tennis Racket, and also my Freezy hair. that's another one. Okay, so Photoroom is available on your phone and on your computer. You choose whatever you prefer. I'm gonna show you how to remove background from pictures using both today and let's start with computer. Start by going on photoroom.com and once you're in, tap on start creating for free. Up here, you will see remove background. So pick your picture. Let's choose this one. It's pretty complex, lots of details. And see, what did I tell you? It literally removed the whole background in under two seconds. And it even left the details, the sprinkles, the ribbon, it's still here. But what if you actually don't want the sprinkles? What if you don't want the details? What you do is that you tap on your object. So in this case, the cake and up here on the right, you'll see edit cutout. And you can either restore, so bring back parts of this image, or you can erase even more. So let's tap on erase and just draw over the object that you want to be erased. Or restore, let's say we wanna restore the table. And also if you wanna edit your picture before you export, you can do it here. You can adjust the brightness, the contrast. If you want to export your image and save it on your computer, go up here and download the image. It will be saved in PNG, which means transparent background, but you can also choose to save it in different formats. I'm gonna go for PNG because I want this to be transparent and see here it is okay so let's move on to our phone if you want to remove background from pictures using photoroom app and you don't have photoroom app scan this qr code download photoroom all you have to do is open the app and you will see start from photo tap on start from photo choose a picture let's choose that picture with me and a tennis racket. I took a lot, so there's plenty to choose from. Um, and a photo room will remove the background for you. I, again, here, like you don't, don't really have to do much. If you wanna edit the cutout, tap on edit cutout and restore or erase part of the image. What if you are an e-commerce seller and you actually want like plain white background or any other plain color? Under the picture, you will see options for more classic backgrounds. So pick a color, we can pick white and you can add shadow, AI generated shadow to make your object, your product appear a bit more realistic. There are actually two ways to remove background using the Photoroom app, just so you know, just so you are aware. The second option is go to AI tools, scroll all the way to the bottom. It's actually a good way to see how many other cool things you can do on Photoroom. For example, you can try clothes on a virtual model, you can create AI images, you can generate logo, you can retouch your picture, Pictures. there's a lot I'm not gonna mention it all anyway scroll down choose remove background and voila what if you are a little self-obsessed and you take way too many pictures well there is a solution for that as well it's called batch mode batch mode allows you to edit multiple pictures at the same time so you don't have to go one by one and remove background from each of them you can choose multiple pictures, remove background from all of them at once. Batch mode is a great way to save time for content creators or e-commerce sellers. But if you are a business, I would highly recommend you to look into our API. Photoroom API basically allows you to remove background or edit thousands of pictures at the same time with one click. So I hope this video was helpful. If you have any other questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section down below. Let me know what other tutorials you would like to see on this channel and don't forget to subscribe i love when people subscribe to this channel i'll hopefully see you soon bye